right. Well, the track kind of stopped here. <laughs> Good morning internet, it is 8 to 12 in the morning and welcome back to the channel. Now in the last video I ended up here right at the border between Argentina and Chile at Paso Seco. I am now right here at the border uh, between Argentina and Chile. So first thing I'm gonna cross the border here right at the border station. <laughs> and then I am going to follow this road um, to San Pedro Atacama which is somewhere over here. So I'm now gonna uh, go to the border, get stamped out of Argentina. The Chilean immigration and customs is also on this side. So it's all in once and then I'm already in Chile. And the plan today is to ride to San Pedro de Atacama, which is including all the detours that I've planned about 275 kilometers. Okay. So this is where the actual border is. <laughs> Paso de Frontera Sico. This is where Chile begins and also where the paved road starts.
just going to follow this track for a little bit uh, to see uh, a lagoon. What a beautiful ride! Uh, I am enjoying every second of it. It is so beautiful everywhere. Volcanoes, lakes, lagoons. Ah, stunning. Looks like this track hasn't been used in some time. <laughs> I think it's not the main route to the lagoons. This is kind of like the back road. So four more kilometers on this track and then I should be there. Right, well the track kind of stopped here. <laughs> I am still three kilometers from the lagoon. Um, but this is the end of the track. <laughs> Beautiful though. Look at this. Oh. Anyway, I'll just ride back and then see if I can find another track. Really cool track though. I mean, <laughs> look where I'm riding. It's incredible. Here is the, pro <laughs> the proper turn off. <laughs> Not my little track. was my visit to the Lagunas. I'm now going down, back down, following this dirt track. And then as soon as I get to the main road, I'm going to look for a place to have a lunch because it is now 12, almost 12.30 and I am starving. Oh, that is where I was riding uh, on the other track, by the way. <laughs> so I, I did come very close, but uh, this is the track you're supposed to take. Let's try to find a lunch here. So it's time for my lunch break. I am having a quinoa omelette with rice and salad. Uh, it looks absolutely amazing. I already finished uh, a vegetable soup, which, which they gave me, which is also really nice. Uh, anyway, uh, what a nice day. Such an amazing ride so far. Um, and now I'm coming down the Andes. Um, so now I think I'm at 3000 something, but I came down like more than a kilometer. Uh, and I'm heading straight for the Atacama Desert. And San Pedro de Atacama, where I'm going today, is in that desert. So it's going to be really super hot there. <laughs> but uh, let's see how it goes. But I'll pass the, the desert a little bit until uh, I reach the town. So uh, let's see, but uh, first uh, finish this. Okay. Let's go. So from here you can see the Atacama Desert, just over there. It's a huge desert, it's uh, 100,000 square kilometers big. And it is one of the driest deserts in the world. 
And that's partly because of ocean currents, but also because the desert over there is right in between the Andes, just over there, and a mountain range which you can see all the way there in the distance. And because the Atacama Desert is right in the middle, you get this effect of a two-sided rain shadow. So that means that rain falls on the other side of that mountain and on the other side of the Andes. And in between it's just completely dry. And I was planning to ride a little bit in the desert to a, a national park, but it's already 1.30 and it's still about 90 kilometers to San Pedro de Atacama. So I'm gonna skip it and just go straight to uh, San Pedro. This is uh, San Pedro de Atacama. Not entirely sure where I am. Very touristy place. Full of tourists. Hostel. So this is the hostel where I'm staying. It's really massive because they have a uh, a whole place here and then rooms over there and then they have another area with like ping pong and everything so uh, i'm really in the backpacker scene at the moment it's been a while see they have a, another area here pretty nice so anyway huge temperature difference uh just coming down from the high mountains right into the Akama, atacama desert uh, just <laughs> i think the temperature increased with like 20 degrees celsius or something really really crazy but um, um yeah and unfortunately uh, i cannot have the no here with me i parked there uh, just outside on the sidewalk uh, when i came in but they said it's not allowed to park on the streets here um, and they also well they wouldn't allow me to put her here i thought she can just live here but okay so uh dono is now sitting like two blocks away in um, some secured parking or something like that so she's all safe just not really close uh, with me <laughs> sad times but uh, okay yeah lovely day really enjoyed the ride it was absolutely magnificent stunning stunning scenery and um, yeah i have to say when you have a paved road through scenery like that it's easier for me to really enjoy it because I don't have to focus so much on the road. So I quite, uh, quite enjoyed that. Um, so that was it for today. I hope you liked this video. If you did, please give me a big thumbs up and subscribe down below. And then I'll see you in the next video.